Hello, welcome back everyone. It's me, Matty G, and we're back with another Gunsmith Simulator. It's our second second video. Um, this is going to be our second gun. Lots of people have said to do certain weaponry. Um, I'm not going to go through them all, but I've, I mean, I was decided from the get-go which one I was pretty much going to go for um, from last time out, and that's the Colt. I'm just hoping that they're not going to ask me to make it horrible. So let's have a quick read. Contracts description. Hey, peace, Peacemaker is, my, is in bad condition, so please fix it as soon as possible. I would also like some nice patterns on it. Doesn't need to be amazing, but I know weapons look better with nice colours. Thanks. Sorry about that accent, I just had to do one. And that's from Jude Jones for $150. Uh, we're going to go with that. Bang. Make it colourful. Why not? Repair and paint. Take to the field and test the operation. They're all optionals. Fantastic. Well, we've, we've accepted our first one for the day. So, peacemaker, peacemaker. Let's make me a match. Oh, 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 that is in rough looking condition. It still looks beautiful, but in real rough condition. Um, all right, I suppose we better start work on it. We're going to have to get this thing stripped down pretty quick. Let's pick it up. Come on, pick up. I always find it hard to get this to pick up. Why won't you? There we go. You're just going to be a pain, aren't you? There we go. Move the screw. Wow, the Colt's actually got quite a few bits and bobs in the handle there. I thought it was real, real, uh, like a just clip off. Didn't realise there were so many screws, but then again, I suppose, being, oh, have I really got to keep picking it up? Makes it harder to do it from this angle. Especially when you got to keep manoeuvring around. So we're going to take these screws off the bottom. Oh, there are actually quite a few screws. There's going to be a screw right there, isn't there? Can we get it from that angle? Yes, we can. All right, I'm going to use my magical cheat button. Let's just take that off first. Whoa. Yeah, I know I'm trying to pick it up, but you keep dropping it down. From there. There was more to come out from that one there. Wish it wouldn't keep zooming in. Making my life a little harder. Trying to pick it up. Trying to pick it up. Don't you know? I'm trying to pick it up. Alright, that's you done. Stop zooming in. And out you come. Seriously, you got to keep picking it up. Why can't I just slid that out where it was? It would have been fine. There we go. Done. So we have four broken, five broken parts? Yeah, five broken parts. We've got the ejector tube, rod, the hammer roll, trigger, and the trigger guard. It's going to cost me a pretty penny. All right, so we'll leave that for now. We have got to get, should we clean them? You know what, we will. We'll clean first. Just so that we can have the say that we've done that. And when we get the parts, we've just got to assemble it all properly then. I'm going to turn it now. There we go. Number one done. 
Apparently number two done. If it's small enough, I'm guessing I haven't even got to turn it. Just kind of hold the rag and turn. Oh, side. There we go, cleaning done. Right, let's leave that and go order some parts. Um, I am intrigued to see what this bidding lock is all about. Auction bidding. Oh, wow. Okay. A slightly used, beautiful macro. Wow, do we, do we get to sell weaponry then? Do we, is that something we can do? I sell. You need to have guns in your personal collection to sell them. Okay. Well, what, what if... I mean... Right, this is something I'm going to look into. I think next time around, maybe, we may even attempt to buy one. I mean, you're only bidding. I think if we bought one on the cheap, did it up, and then reflogged it for more money... Could be a way of earning some extra cash but that's then this is now at the moment we need a colt so uh that should come under revolvers wouldn't it yep so we need ejector tube ejector rod hammer roll I see the tube and the rod. Hammer roll, hammer roll. Hammer roll. Hammer roll. There, it's just hiding behind the, uh, what's this called? The shopping list. And we just need trigger and trigger guard. Probably going to be on the second page. Uh, trigger and trigger guard. That's going to come to 110. Ah, oh, man. I've spent my own money. That's going to eat into profits. I didn't even know that was a possibility, considering I'm only getting the parts that are needed. Right, now we've got a new parts. So grab the bits that are broken, swap them out. This bit's fairly simple. And that bit one over there. Beautiful. Grab the oil rag. Tap all these bits. Right, here we go. We've got to assemble now. So, where should we start? Start with the small bits, apparently. I say there should be a pin there somewhere. I wish it was a little easier to maneuver things. Wish it wouldn't keep zooming in that far. Doesn't allow you that when it zooms in really close when you don't want it to. 
or puts things down when you don't want it to. It can get rather annoying. Come on, let me maneuver. I thought it was four screws when we undone it. No, that's just a three. That's an easy job. That one in. Did he just drop it? There we go, that's better. We got paint, 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 paint. I mean, I'd have thought engraving would have been better than painting, but each to their own, I guess. Right, okay, 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 got it. Select one of the patterns or full colour as a base for your new paint. They got Damascus. <laughs> uh, okay, can I? Okay, I get, I get it. All right, got stickers. Yes, yes, yes. Weathered and yeah, yeah. Finish. Right. So, is it like a preview? I'm going a sort of yellowy colour. Highly metallic, very glossy. Oh, click something there. Uh, what's this one? That pattern looks good. If I can get it in a goldy colour. Ooh, no, 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 no. More metallic -y. All the way metallic -y. It's not costing me to paint this, is it? Is this double sided when I'm painting it? Uh, manipulate horizontal. frozen no don't freeze on me I haven't saved wait we oh there we go it's working now right so we're playing oh, I've done it again I want black how do I get black I want metallic glossy Hammer and black, black strap and black. Just want the trigger. Can I not just get the trigger? Apparently, I can't get the trigger. I don't want. To, I just want the trigger. Just the trigger. Right, I can't get the trigger. That bit black, that bit black. Can't get the trigger. Can't get the screws, can't get the trigger. 
Won't hit the trigger. What else can we do with this to make it outrageous? Uh, what about this whitish colour? Let me select it. Yeah, back to this. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Come on, this thing's running a little slow. Doesn't like all this. Alright, I'm back on the black. Right, that's how you do the handle, got it. I don't want to use that though. <laughs> I want bright white. red spotted red that is outrageously bad um Yeah, that day finish work. <laughs> it looks awful. There's a bad, bad paint job gone wrong. But then again, you shouldn't be painting one of these. Send back to the client now. We'll go out for testing. Well, we got a six shooter and we got a close quarter combat area. Why don't you go in? I want you to take the gun. Yes. There we go. Why not CQB? Why not do this one again and see if this does better than the 911 did? But obviously, I should do better with it because um, I was awful the first time around. Right, here we go. Could do a, Oh, hello. We've got to wait for the shader. Oh, it's, it's not liking it today. A few seconds. Come on. Chill out. Right. Click to open. Random targets. Yes, please. All right. Three, two, one. We're going to try and do it. Hang on. I'm frozen, am I? Oh, I'll press G to start. Try and get a speed run going here. Probably not going to get a speed. Oh, wow, loading takes forever. That went bad. I've got three shots left. Oh crap, bang, 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 I'm dead. Yeah, this is definitely gonna be slower. <laughs> uh, can I can I just shoot now? Yeah, um, 
This is not a speed run. <laughs> That's absurd. It takes so long to load. I mean, like, forever to load. Nice try. Oops. Ah! One. Two. I'm going to get cocky. That's got to be all I need. And we're out there. Good, because I was out. That was... Final result. Oh, yeah. I didn't hit any civilians again, though. That's twice in a row. That's... On a plus side, and there's a fire selector. Actually, looks all right. The pattern looks all right. The handle looks a bit iffy. But yeah, I actually quite kind of kind of like it now. <laughs> anyway, let's get this one back and send it off to the client and see if we actually make any money out of it. We know the action works, we don't got to test the action because we've just taken it out in the field and got annihilated. <laughs> so, yes, okay, as much as six shooters look good, the Cowboys made it look easy. They really did. Alright, so click on that and... There we go. Away. Oh, peacemaker, done. All right, I'll send back to the client. Uh, current jobs, send it back. All right, let's see how they do. Shooting at finest. Ha! Here we go. Alex Tira. Alice, sorry. Do apologise for anyone named Alice out there, and I got your name butchered it there. Uh, how is your new workplace? You are not even answering calls from your best friend. Hang on. This isn't from our customer, is it? Anyway. So I believe there is a lot of work. Listen, your grandpa came back to the shooting range. Would you come too? I will clean it a little. I'm sending an address. As I'm writing this email, you should get it as soon as mail comes to you. You can check it in the car. Shooting range is on the private field, so feel free to shoot as much as you want. Don't destroy anything. You can check your accuracy there or shoot some discs. You have a private gun, right? See you soon, Alice. So that wasn't from the customer. I mean, that's... We, we, we did get paid, right? I got 150 for it, I'm guessing. But we didn't get no feedback at all. Um, okay. No current jobs. We definitely sent it out. Can I refresh? No? Okay. Fair enough. Right, so. Um, that is going to be the end of this one. Uh, but before we do go, let's have a little look what we have ready up here for next week. I don't know if these change. We've got another cult. This one's very damaged. Howdy. I did not use this weapon for a long time, and a few days ago I decided to take a shot and try refreshing it. Unfortunately, that's too much for me. This gun has a lot of damaged parts. Will you be able to fix it? <sighs> for that sort of price, I don't know. I mean, requires fixing a gun that is currently not functional. Requires maintenance work. Um, You've given me... You, you pay me 100 quid, but it doesn't, it doesn't tell me what their repair budget is and we saw with the last cult their repair budget was 85 and i had to spend more in order to actually get the job done uh we've also got by the looks of it three m4 carbines various price ranges that being the cheapest one modern standard they want a shorter rifle and they want a shorter rifle uh good morning my m4 was modified a bit to be a little longer i think I don't feel comfortable with it, so I would like it change it back to basic version M4. Nothing new or fancy. Thank you. Um, I won an auction for a very basic M4, and unfortunately I did not see that it is very bad shape. I believe it is something you can manage. It is just a few damaged parts. Nothing that should be worried about. 
Good morning, my M4 was modified a bit longer. Same sort of thing as the other one. Okay, these are, yeah, retro bits. Um, and this is what's on auction today. A damaged Peacemaker for 400. Now, if we go on the last Peacemaker and we've got a repair four or five bits, I wonder what a non-damaged one goes for do you get me so I mean that is a peacemaker gunsmithing will be required to repair it there were problems detected with cylinder and receiver on this auction we provide a weapon that was used to experiment with different ammunition and for this reason some parts are damaged It's four hundred dollars. It's the cheapest one on there. I mean, I think personally, next time we come on, we should be grabbing one of these and trying to make a bit of money that way. If you think I'm crazy, let me know in the comments. Um, but yeah, I think that's what we're, we're going to go with. We'll at least try it. Unless you all tell me to shut up and get back to gunsmithing the old-fashioned way and stop being a whiny Brit. <laughs> but either way please like subscribe and share with your friends uh get them all coming over and uh let's have a laugh together so until next time this has been matty g on gunsmith peace out